All right, y'all, what's up? It's Born Again. This video is just an encouraging video, really. For many of you, many of you, for somebody who feels like, yo, they've been putting in work, putting in work, putting in work, but they're not yet at the, they're not yet where they would like to be. And trust me, if anybody knows about that, I know about that firsthand. Been through it, right? Been through it in many ways in certain areas of my life, still going through it, okay? But I just want to encourage you to continue going. And it might sound simple, right? And I, I don't just mean it in the cliche kind of way where people say, yo, you know, you just got to keep going. No, keeping on going, I know it's tough. To keep on going is hard. To keep on going sometimes almost feels like torture. But what I would hate is for you to be at step number four, and there are five steps to go through. And if you just keep on going through, you'll get through that next step, and God will eventually bless you at that next step. I would hate for you to see you stop at stage four when you're so close, right? And here's why that's even more important. Or, or rather than let me say it's more important, let me say this. Just because you're at stage four does not necessarily mean that continuing going means to continue doing exactly what you're doing, right? Being at stage four might simply mean you need to look at what you're doing, see if it's the right thing to be doing, or there's some things that need to be tweaked, doing an assessment of what you're doing. Can it be done more efficiently? Can it be done quicker? Can it be done better, right? At this point in time, do you have the resources to do it better? And if you do have the resources to do it better, maybe making the adjustment, and then all of a sudden you'll be propelled into stage five where the blessing might come, right? But for many people, what happens is that we might be going through the stages, and we, I'm not saying it's good. I'm glad that you're giving effort, and I don't want you to give up. I'm glad that you're giving effort. But continue, keeping on going or continuing going or continuing to stay to make progress does not necessarily mean just doing what you've always been doing, right? But the next step might mean to make some adjustments. But I just want you to, whatever it might be, right? Continue making some of the mistakes as long as, well, and well, watch this, you might have to analyze, are these mistakes too costly, right? Because if it's some real costly mistakes, you don't want to do that, right? So you want to count the cost before you do anything. But continue trying. Continue, exp maybe experimenting is the better word that I should use. Continue experimenting and seeing what works, what doesn't work, and eventually you might find yourself right there at stage five where you've been looking to get to, right? And trust me, I know that it's hard, like, for real. Trust, there's some days where I'm like, man, I don't even feel like shooting these videos. Why? Because shooting these videos takes up a, it takes time out of my day, and I love to shoot the videos. I'd rather be shooting the videos than other things, but when I'm finished with the, you know, the, what I have to do for my nine to five, when I finish, when I finish uh, what I have to do for pastoring the church that I pastor, um, when I finish doing what I have to do, uh, like, I almost get no breaks, <laughs> you know what I'm saying? So I could be taking a break right now and resting, but what I've decided to do is, because I have certain goals, for my life and also because I have certain goals that I want to see or not I have certain goals but I know that some of you have goals and may, some of y'all may not have encouragement I just want to make sure that I'm consistent in encouraging you you see what I'm saying so I say all of that to say this right keep on going keep on figuring out ways that you can get better be better and continue making a, making progress I preached this sermon once that said listen you know even if it's only a step that you're taking one step in the right direction is still a good step right? In the beginning, God created the, the heavens and the earth. He did it in six days, and then on the seventh day, he rested, right? But watch this. It says at the end of the sixth day that it was very good, right? But the first day, the second day, the third day, the fourth day, the fifth day, the sixth day, um, the fifth day, the only thing that it says is that it was good. It's not until he reached the, 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 the end of the actual creation that it said that it was very good, and then when it got to the seventh day, it said that it was blessed. But watch this. The first step is still good, right? The first step is still good. So even if it's just a step in the right direction, it might not be very good yet. It might not even be blessed yet, but it's still good. So continue doing what is good. And I, 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 I bet you eventually you make it to very good. And I bet you eventually you make it to that blessed, that platform of blessings, man. So I'm hoping that for you. I'm praying for that for you, right? Peace out.